have a dog. She has a dog. Hi, everybody. Hi. Welcome back. Um, we're here. Tyler is apparently being blown away by the quality of my voice. Uh, we're here again, reacting to Eurovision today. We're reacting to Moldova. I didn't know. He didn't know. Um, if you're not aware, Tyler just has this um, perennial love affair with Moldova in Eurovision. Uh, yes. So his. It says Greece. I know we're on a different tab. This will be my most. This will be my most biased reaction every yes. single year. So the artist is Pasha Parfeni, and the song is called Soarele Shi Luna. So let us give our initial impressions based on nothing but the information I just gave you. Tyler, you first. Um, I believe that she will have a small cup of layered yogurt <laughs> treat. Okay. <laughs> That's so specific. <laughs> so parfait. a trifle. A parfait. Because par parfaitny. <laughs> wow. Wow. Carolina. Yeah. I'm very uh, clever. <laughs> so uh, this is gonna be. I don't know what Sorelli is. We're just gonna say it's either solar. It's probably not. We're soaring over the moon, so I'm really hoping there's a giant moon, and it would be extra, extra amazing if there is a. If there's like a bird that like a silhouette you could see go across. Across the moon. Across the moon. Okay. All right. Um, I think this will be a very happy song. I think that there is going to be lots of flowy skirts. All right. Those are our impressions based on nothing. <laughs> We're going to figure out what we actually have. Again, this is Moldova's entry for Eurovision 2023. You guys ready? Yeah. Let's go. Absolutely. Yeah. That's a great intro. You hush. Oh. Okay. Yes. Male-led vocals. I was not prepared. Yeah. Is that a smoking jacket? That's definitely a smoking jacket. I like it. <laughs> Hey, Moldova's really bringing up the production value. Yeah, this is a much more involved video than usual. Chops, 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 chops. Hey, can you give me a little bit more harmony? Alright, alright. So leaning heavy into the folk instrumentation, but dance vibe. Learning a few lessons from Ukraine. Creepy twins from The Shining have grown up. <laughs> yep. Moved into the forest. I mean, wouldn't you? Yes. A small person. Getting real heavy pagan vibes. 100%. That is a deep V. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the deepest V. I love timpani. Drums. So much. <laughs> so, yeah. Always need drums in Eurovision. What is her purpose? I'm sure it has everything to do with the lyrics. Yes. Well, I her little know. cup thing said door, like D O R. I don't know what that means. Mm. She's the virgin they're going to sacrifice. I don't think she is. She has antlers. I feel like that's unlikely. She's who they're sacrificing to. If that seems more likely. <laughs> okay. Very breathy head voice. Interesting stylization. I'm 
I want more of them singing harmony, but that's just me personally. got a great rack. It had to be said. <laughs> if anyone was going to say Nobody it, it had else, to be you. No, no other video will contain that comment. <laughs> wow, Tyler. <laughs> I'm wow. so clever. Wow. Oh, I forgot we have to, like, make that go away so Tyler doesn't get distracted by the other videos that YouTube's <laughs> recommending. All right. Um, thoughts? I'll, I'll go first since go. this is Do it. a perennial favorite. Um. This is very different from historical, well, historical, I can't speak to history, but like the last like at least six or eight years yeah. of Who Moldovan remembers entries. Who remembers that? Yeah. Uh, so, but very cool. Uh, yes, very much of a Goa vibe yeah. to some extent um, in terms of the the blending, right? That, right. that folk EDM blend, mm -hmm. um, which I dig. I mean, I liked Goa a lot. I like this, uh, for the same reasons. His voice is pretty good. He has, seems to have a really good dynamic range, which I think helps with some variety in the song. So he's not, it's not just this the whole time. Cause the song doesn't really do much of a wave, right? Like there's sure. not a lot <clears throat> of up and down in it. Excuse me. Um, but, uh, it's more, um, it's more with his voice that he sent that he does mm -hmm. that right. Mm -hmm. The backing track and everything's kind of here, mm -hmm. so I I could do with a little more dynamics in the backing track. They just seem to pull some instrumentation out here and there, but they don't do any real dynamic range with it. Um, but other than that, like I I really I do like the song. Actually, I think this is actually not just my bias speaking. It's pretty enjoyable. Right. Number. It's it's easier for me to believe that your feelings on the song are are not just biased. There have been a few Moldovan entries that you've been like, yes, I love it. I'm like, really? <laughs> but <laughs> okay. I do. Like, I, am, I can't think of one that I actually genuinely didn't like and decided to like anyway. <laughs> right. Uh, That's because you didn't know. <laughs> it's, like, it's possible. It's possible. Um, but yeah, I, th this was a good vibe. It was good. I don't know that it will go very far in finals, but I think it will probably make it to finals. Um, so just a personal See. thought, I think uh, it'll be in my draft as usual. Um, it's gotta be. I'm gonna pick it, it first just to be that guy. Do oh, it. that would be rude. Uh, yeah. Yeah, good song. And uh, the video, there's a lot going on. Moderately distracting, but not terribly. Right? Like well, the, I mean, I don't know what's being sung, but I yeah. I assume that it was going along with Fairly the lyrics. related, yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah. There's a lot happening in yeah. there. So. Which we appreciate. Mm -hmm. Carlina. Let's make our way. Uh, yeah. So I do agree with the whole, like, the dynamic, like, the modulation of the song. I really would have liked a lot more of that in the backing track as well, like, just the instrumentation. But, to its credit, I do like that it was broken up, um, like, just the dance vibe beat was broken up with the uh, folk instruments, because mm -hmm. I felt like that gave it more of a sense of that, instead of it just being so flat, which, the dance vibe was great, too, but I think uh, if, it was, if it was missing that, I don't think it would have been as good of a song. Mm -hmm. It would have just kind of become background, like, lull for me. Um, I do really like his voice and the backup singers. Mm -hmm. I, yeah, definitely, mm -hmm. uh, more harmony on that would be great. But it sounded like, and I know this is a music video, so you would think this isn't the case, but when he's singing and it's like in the song and it's not just them, you can hear them, just not very well. And so I'm wondering yeah. if the mixing, like if they, if there's something there that like, if they just brought them out more. Mm -hmm. Because, yeah, they're doing stuff back there. Well, a not... lot of it was them singing in octaves, mm. and which sounded good, but I think I just wanted like three more singers just all doing harmony yeah. <laughs> on top of, of it. Less yeah. depth when you do the octaves, right? Like yeah, sure. sure. Yeah. Well, in the first part, they weren't even doing octaves; they were singing unison. Yes, mm. with him. Yeah. Gotcha. So it kind of all just blended in as kind of one mass sound. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I don't have much more to say other than what I already said. I don't feel like I have to add anything. Um, I'm feeling kind of about this song. Like, I think that 
we've <laughs> I think that we've had a lot of songs in this same style mm -hmm. recently that it's not necessarily sticking out to me as very unique from those other ones. Mm -hmm. Um with the uh folk sound, sure, folk, folk instruments, but then also the dancey. So, like, I don't dislike it. I think that he's mm. good at singing. It's just, it's like, mm, it's not really sticking out to me. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, I think Goa absolutely kind of set the bar on this one, and it's a pretty high bar. In, that, in this style, you know. Sure. Yeah, I could see that. Yeah. Um, did France do it last year? Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. So, I still I... like it, but I get it. Yeah, I think that it's really gonna depend which semifinal they're in. Which I know it's already out there, but I just haven't listened to all the songs yet, so yeah. I can't accurately make an assessment on how it will do in the semifinal. Um, and I like his vibe. Like, mm -hmm. the smoking him, jacket. It's not a smoking oh jacket, but I I I enjoy him in general. Yeah, he, he he seems fun. He didn't like he has strong, powerful vocals, but they don't seem try hard to me. Mm. Like he's not trying to show off literally everything he can do. Like he's just being solid, and in his strength. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, would you add this to a playlist? Uh, this would go on my Moldova playlist. <laughs> that is fair. <laughs> <laughs> Are there of you? Um, my cooking playlist. Okay. You could keep me in a good vibe while cooking. No. My would not. <laughs> this is adding, <clears throat> getting added to her no playlist. Uh, all right. Any closing <laughs> thoughts? I think that probably does it for us for our very initial thoughts on hearing this for the first time. Um... I think it's a pretty good entry. Moldova always tends to bring good staging, so we'll see what happens. Let us know mm -hmm. what your thoughts on this song are and how you think Moldova's going to do in their semifinal, and we will be back with another video. Uh, next up, we have Iceland, so join us there. Thanks, guys. Bye. Okay, bye.